What's good, YouTube? We got a quick one for you. You just got your new Xbox Series X, Series S, or maybe one of the other Xboxes, whatever the case may be, and they really streamlined the setup process. It really will set it just like you had your last console, but you might not like that no more. You might want to change it because me personally, I know I've seen that you can do some nice backgrounds on the new Xboxes. So this is how you change that background from whatever you had it to, to something different. All you got to do is go to settings. And then once you get into settings, you want to come over to personalization, click that right there. And then once you click it, you want to come down here to my background. You can choose this. And then once you choose this, you see you can remove the custom background that you had. And then if you hit home, it should go to one of the, you know, ones that this new Xbox has. So going back into that, clicking back to my background, you can even choose a certain dynamic one by going down and selecting it. And as you can see, you have all these different options to choose from. You see we have waves. We have waves faded. We have spotlight ultraviolet. We have midnight. We got the uh, Deja Goo. <laughs> they ain't never have to do a play on words for Deja Vu. And then we got ribbons. Uh, ribbons kind of looking, you know, a little, little nice, a little subtle, something, something, something slight. And then you got ripple. And then we got moats. And then we got the original Mercury sitting there chilling. And if you go up to the top, you have some other choices up here as far as Xbox. We got that one. Then we got this one. This is looking real old school, quite bright. I'm not fooling with it. And then you got these right here. Got that nice subtle glow to the to the chief stuff going on in the background. This one right here. You got this dynamic one, too. You know, subtle, but it looks cool. It looks nice. And then you got this one right here. If this floats your boat let it float your boat now this one right here i'm not gonna lie to you this looks very beautiful <laughs> this looks my chef's kiss but let's go back to one of these other ones you can even change the color as well so if you hit the um button down below what is this button called is it the is this the page button i have no clue it's not the start button but you can change the color to whatever you like, whatever looks beautiful to you. Choose and select that knock online. The magenta looking quite nice. Keep looking through these bad boys. We got gold, mm, brown, oh yeah. And then we got tan. So you can just go through here and choose whichever one you think looks the nicest. I've been rocking with uh, the dark blue for right now. So I'm gonna just leave mine like that. Come back out of that. And there we have it looking quite nice looking quite spiffy the new console is looking like a new console because sometimes you just want to you know freshen things up you don't want to keep using the same wallpaper you used on the last console when you got a different console you might want to change it up a bit like i just did and as always if this video helped you out please slam that like button is greatly appreciated and i'll see you in the next one peace